This morning on Early Does It Green Organic Clothes. In the past several years, eco-friendly fashion has gone from hippie to extremely hip. Here with some very cool green outfits is Jessica Zerman, editor of Plenty Magazine. Hey, good to have you with me again. Hey, yeah, nice to be back. So you brought several outs with outfits. We can't wait to see them. Yeah. Let's bring out our first model, Katrina. And Katrina is wearing a bamboo dress. Mm -hmm. How do you make a bamboo dress? Well, you make bamboo a lot like you make linen. They just extract the fiber and weave it into um, thread. And her dress is absolutely gorgeous because it's an eco-chic little black dress. It has a really silky feel. And if you don't want to wear it in such a fancy way, you can just reverse it and make it into a cowl neck t-shirt. It looks like an ordinary black dress. Yeah, it's the little black dress. Yep, and let's talk about the shoes because you know you see patent leather heels everywhere, but these are eco-friendly. How? Yeah. Well, they're made by, they're a line that Natalie Portman designed for Take Us On. And Natalie Portman, she's really known for her animal-friendly fashion. And they're a great alternative to real patent leather. They're faux, so they're not mm. made with any animal products. Even the clutch that she's wearing, it's, it's an example of something called repurposing. Yeah. What is that? It's just taking something old and making it new, which is a lot of what eco is about. Recycling. Recycling. It's yeah. old leather, and it's, I mean, it's beautiful. You'd never know. Beautiful. I would never know any of that <laughs> is organic. All right, thank you very much, Katrina. Let's bring out Will. Everybody has been wanting this solar pa paneled jacket that he's been wearing. Yeah. I think when I wore it, it interfered with my microphone. <laughs> so explain how it works. It's got a built-in charger? Yeah, so in the collar are solar panels. It pulls in energy from the sun and uses it to power an adapter, which is in the pocket. So you can plug in your BlackBerry or your cell phone, and it charges on the go. Is this something that's readily available? Yeah, it, it is. People are buying it? People are buying it. Celebrities, it's the same thing I bet, you love see it. in backpacks and camera bags, all these travel accessories, only now it's in clothing, so it's clean, portable power. Awesome. What else? The t shirt, everything, the whole outfit is green? The whole outfit, top to bottom. Green fashion is fashion, and the t shirt not only is it organic cotton, but it also it lets you, you know, you've heard of Walk the Walk, it yep. lets you wear the talk. Yep. Lenny Kravitz just bought one that says In War, Sharon Stone picked up one in Sundance. So it's just, it's a great way to say how you feel. What is organic cotton? Cotton is the most popular fabric used in the world, but it's also one of the most toxic because it requires so many chemicals. So organic cotton is a way to meet the demand without having to use all the chemicals. Very good. Thanks a lot, Will. Appreciate it. All right, finally we have Megan. And what is Megan wearing? Megan is wearing an or a denim organic cotton dress by Linda Loudermilk, who is really a pioneer of eco-fashion. So cute. And the umbrella is biodegradable, it's, is that right? We love this umbrella. That's the it's, coolest thing. It's actually featured in the latest issue of Plenty. And so it's made from a bamboo frame, which, as we said, is completely sustainable and renewable. And the plastic, which comprises the, the shade, uh -huh. is, is biodegradable. So, you know, you always lose your umbrella. And that's time, okay. You don't have to worry about it. Exactly. <laughs> All the accessories, too? All the accessories. So Even the jewelry. Even the jewelry. So there's a designer, Lulu Frost, who takes old things like mm -hmm. room numbers from the plaza, room keys. The bracelet on her arm that's holding the umbrella is made from an old shoe buckle. And the beads are actually old newspapers and magazines made by Rwandan refugees. Oh, so it's, awesome. yeah, it's a really great way to take old stuff and help people. Again, that repurposing. That repurposing, How yeah. How clever. Exactly. All right, so we've seen lots of great stuff. We see that it looks just as fashionable, if not more so than regular stuff. Is there any downside? Is it more expensive? Well, you know, green fashion is fashion. People want to look good, and it's a growing industry, which means that you know, people like Walmart and Target are making it more affordable. So there's something for every price point, and that's something people really should remember. Yeah, the more it catches on, the more the affordable better. it will. Yeah, and, it's, and the more accessible. All right. Thank you. Always interesting, Jessica. Thanks a lot. All right, let's go over to Harry with uh, my friend Bobby Flay. So if you dump the umbrella yeah. right in the rain, Will it melt or? No, it's actually surprisingly durable. It, oh, so it'll hold up until you're done with it, and then it'll biodegrade in about 18 months. Really cool. In a bamboo dress, right? Yeah. In a bamboo dress. Really cool. <laughs> it's very nice. Yeah. So to this that segment before this segment, too hip. Let's you're roll right. Hip Let's roll hip. right in. Can we try and? We're gonna try, we're gonna get force our way into the hipness. All right, because because okay. you know what this month is.